Who does the DOJ work for? I'm looking at this story today. Former Attorney General Barr dumbfounded at DOJ's decision to release letter of Trump's would-be assassin. This is dated September 23, 2024. Bill Barr, it served no purpose other than to risk inciting further violence. Ruth is the suspect in former President Donald Trump's second foiled assassination attempt. The DOJ attempt obtained the letter from a witness who says they received it inside a box delivered to them by Ruth several months prior. The box contains several handwritten letters. One of the letters addressed Dear World admitted to an assassination attempt on Trump. He also offered money to anyone willing to finish the job. I was dumbfounded that the DOJ made public this morning the contents of the letter that Brian Ruth left with an acquaintance prior to the attempted assassination of former President Trump, Barr said in a statement. The letter calls on people to finish the job of killing President Trump, attempts to rouse people to do so, and offers 150000 to anyone who succeeds. There was no apparent justification for releasing this information at this stage. Even if the DOJ thought it important to provide the letter to the court, it could have redacted inflammatory material or arranged to have the letter submitted under seal. It served no purpose other than to risk inciting further violence. So this is something you can test yourself. Type in DOJ Trump redacted. And what comes up? Endless releases by Biden's Department of Justice where they have redacted documents that would permit Donald Trump to defend himself and exonerate him possibly from the multiple indictments that the Biden administration under the Department of Justice has brought against Donald Trump. But when it comes to an assassin's letter, folks, this is exactly seven days after this assassin tried to kill Trump at the golf course. And they release his full letter, unredacted, this is incredible. I can't believe this is the country we're living in in 2024. God help our country. God help us all.